Brooke Shields had a fierce fight with Meghan Markle right on stage at the South by Southwest event in Austin, Texas on Friday. Meghan Markle delivered an empowering speech at South by Southwest Festival in Texas on Friday which came as Prince Harry supported his wife from the front row. Meghan took part in a keynote speech titled, Breaking Barriers, Shaping Narratives, How Women Lead on and Off the Screen. Also joining Meghan on the panel were journalist Katie Kirk, actress Brooke Shields, and diversity, equity, and inclusion consultant Nancy Wong Yuan. While chatting on the panel, Meghan touched on how she advocated for Procter & Gamble to change a dishwashing soap advert when she was 11 years old due to the adulterated connotations its television advert had. Speaking during the opening day keynote panel, Meghan shared a story about how she took on a sensitive TV ad in her youth. She said, I was 11 years old. I'd seen a commercial for a dishwashing liquid and the boys in my class said, yeah, that's where women belong in the kitchen. And at 11, I just found that infuriating. I wrote letters and they ended up changing the commercial. But after sharing her story, Megan appeared a little taken aback when panelist Brooke Shields joked, this is one of the ways we differ. When I was 11, I was playing a prostitute. I wish I'd known you when I was 11. When Brooke was a youngster, she starred as the daughter of a prostitute in the 1978 film Pretty Baby, which was based on a true story. Megan could be heard making an inaudible mumble before laughing as she said, a little different. Brooke Shields' joke was said to be intentional because she was implicitly criticizing Meghan Markle because Harry's wife herself played adultery roles in ads and movies in the past. She also worked as a yacht girl serving men. Meghan is making empty and hypocritical statements when talking about women's rights like this. Brooke Shields hadn't heard Megan's washing up liquid story. It's been repeated so many times. How many more times is Megan going to reference this event from her childhood? If that's the full extent of her fighting for women's rights, then she shouldn't be listing it as a personal accolade on the Archwell website. Moreover, Megan said that she wrote in a letter to PNG, Dear Sir, last week at my school we decided to watch the news for social studies. While flicking through the channels, we saw a commercial for the new ivory clear dishwashing liquid. In the commercial, they said women are battling grease, meaning only women do dishes. When I heard this, the boys in my class started saying, yeah, that's where women belong in the kitchen. So I was wondering if you could change this to people all over America. PNG decided to change the lingo of the ad in favor of Megan's suggestions. However, Megan's soap commercial story has been debunked. It never happened the way she describes it. This was a school project and Hillary Clinton has denied any knowledge of a letter Meghan's father admitted to writing back to her pretending to be the firm. He wanted to make her feel good, yet she's still banging on about it. She really does insult people's intelligence. So PNG didn't respond to her. In fact, Meghan is rewriting history again.